Hi again. So, it's what's this? Few days to Halloween. I think we're like two or three days away. So, in the spirit, I decided to do a video featuring my favorite fall colors in the purple range. So, as you already know from other videos, I'm a very much a connoisseur of lipstick. To me, no outfit is complete, no look is complete without lippies. Yes, my face is done, but my lips are bare, so to me, I'm not done. I might as well just not even have anything else on my face right now, in my opinion. But that's just me. But, um, and me, one of my, let's see, one of my newer purchases I recently picked up, and it is the wet and wild what's this 919b better known as vamp it up it's very much close to the matte color cyber a lot of people use it and say it's a dead-on dupe so naturally i picked it up because i didn't want to pick up cyber i mean hey 15 dollars versus two dollars that's a big difference so let me try it on for you Very rich, very creamy. Yep. Sorry guys, my mirror's down below. Okay. And I believe in putting it on thick. That's how I would wear it. And I believe you're gonna do a real tutorial of lipstick and each show what it looks like in real life, not just a little bitty swatch. Vamp it up. Very deep. Hmm. I'm gonna actually wear it today what I have on. <laughs> okay, moving forward. Standing within the drugstore range, I have a black radiance lip color. Its number is 5117. And this one is better known as Plum Orchid. It's very greasy, very creamy. Another $2 fine. Picked it up at Walgreens. Just like I picked up the, the Wet and Wild one from Rite Aid. So, yeah, just pull over. Use your own corners. You can get you one. There you have it. Plum Orchid. Alright, keep it moving. Deep Purple Range. My baby. This one is my baby. I was so happy when I found this color last year. It is by Maker Forever. I picked it up in my local Sephora. This is what it looks like. And if you were a Maker Forever person, you understand that Maker Forever doesn't actually use real names. They use numbers for theirs. And this is number 49. And it's described as a true deep boysenberry pur purplish color. But it's very, very, it's a cross between a satin and a matte. So it's right in the middle and perfect for a deep vampy lip. There we have it. My favorite one. Number 49 by Makeup Forever. Alright, let's keep it moving. Hmm. We're halfway done. Okay. Mm -mm. Also, keep in mind too that with these being plumish, purplish colors, they tend to stain a little reddish a little time, as if you would bite, like when you bite into a plum. So be cognizant of that, especially when you're reapplying and when you eat. Mm -hmm. Okay, I might need to add a little Vaseline. Drugs are fine. Get some Vaseline. Soften the lips. Okay. Mm. 
Yeah, but those are the darkest color, so it should be more up here from this point. <laughs> All right, next we're going to do another black radiance fine. Yay, go drugstores. Now this one is more of a happy color. Sorry, it's a little messy in the tube. A little messy around here. But isn't that a gorgeous color? It's like an electric violet, but it's called African Violet number 5112. For those who want to hunt it down, like I said, again, I picked it up at my local Walgreens. Very pretty color. I usually pair this with either MAC Vino's liner or MAC Magenta liner. Depends on how I feel. But some days you still want a purple, but you don't want to do dark purple. And this is a good option. So creamy. So creamy. Man, I don't know where I've been without black radiance lipsticks. I know my mother uses them. She's used them for years. It's a very old brand. But new school, we tend to go, go towards MAC all the time. It's a four. But hey, I use some of your old classics too. And this one pays off. Look at that color. Hmm. 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 I'm gonna take it off. It's kind of pretty good though. Alright, now we're gonna turn it turn it down a little bit more. And this is another wet and wild color. So this is a 916D. It's Raven Raisin. And this is like a muted purple. I like it. This is for good for a calm day. You don't want to do too much. You just still want to look like you're in a season. Again, just put it on. Sure, purple. But well, you don't feel like being so ah with your lips. I like it. It was one of those good unexpected finds I was happy to pick up. Yay! Now to the fun purples. <laughs> now, this one I picked up via Instagram. And this is a new brand. It's by a company called Rock. Rockstar Cosmetics, and I remember I picked it up because back during the fashion set craze, I understand a lot of people wanted the color heroin. Me personally, I didn't know nothing about the fanatic and craze, and everybody wanted it, so I picked up Silly and a Blaze during that season. And then afterwards, like about two months later, I figured out, I said, like, Oh, y'all understand the hype around the color heroin. So in the meantime, I found me a nice, dead on, exact dupe by the color Rockstar Cosmetics. and. I freaking love this color. It's a nice, it's a matte too as well. The packaging is adorable. It's really cute. And it's become one of my favorite purples to wear these days with smoky looks or like electric green eyes. I want them feeling really bold that day. But yeah, let me show you what it looks like. creamy matte lipstick it's a great dupe to max heroin ladies so definitely pick this up even though i feel like mac is going to make heroin permanent just like they make handy yum yum but in the meantime this is the best color i've seen that looks just like it so kudos to the new company making the color all right mm -hmm. lastly Fun purple. You've seen me feature this color in one of my first videos I ever did. But it is by K.O.R. Which I absolutely love her brand if you know that about me. And it is called, what's this one? Rude Girl. Love it, love it, love it. It's a very happy purple. Thing about her lipsticks, as I've already stated in like my four videos I did on her colors. 
How it looks in a tube is how it looks on your mouth. So you see how loud this purple is? That's how it's going to look on me. And for what I've seen, it looks like the way on any skin tone too. So that's always great. This is Party Girl Purple. Ooh, very loud. Mm -mm -mm, I'm so red around my lips. Very loud, very Party Girl Purple. This one definitely makes a statement, especially right now with all this chunky jewelry phase that's going on right now. It's a definitely a staple color to get. I love it. 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 I love it so much. I'm even considering getting her lighter color shade called Raquel. So we'll see what happens with it. But for now, that is my purple lippies for fall. Keep watching. I should be doing maybe like a wine ox blood lippy video too. We'll see what happens. Depends on how I feel. Emotions. Not how it goes. All right. Talk to you later, people. Bye bye.